Hello viewers, this is IT System Admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today I am going to show you how to deny or disable and then enable back access to control panel and setting in your Windows 10 computer. So don't forget to watch full video. You know control panel and settings are most important as well as most sensitive area of your Windows computer. You need to protect it from general users as because general users may change or remove your important settings or configurations. As a result, your computer may damage permanently. Okay, let's see how to configure it. Go to search bar and type GP edit. Okay, edit group policy. Uh, control panel settings is uh, appeared. Now open it. Local group policy editor has been opened. Okay. Now expand in the configuration. We will configure control panel deny access in user configuration. Okay. So go to expand administrative template then look here uh, we found control panel ok click on control panel then so here is the option that prohibit access to control panel and PC settings ok right click on it and click edit Settings has been opened. Now, very simple configuration. Just click on enable. Prohibit access to control panel and PC settings. We have to enable it. Okay. Just click on enable, and then click to apply. And okay. Now I am going to check whether I am able to open control panel or not. Okay, type in search box control panel. Click on control panel. Look, restriction. This operation has been cancelled due to restrictions in effect on this computer. Please contact your system administrator. Okay. Yeah, so, it is proved that uh, I cannot access to control panel. Now I am trying to open settings. Click on start. Click on settings. Okay. I cannot open settings. Okay. okay. Now, Again, I want to enable access to control panel. Okay, go to group policy editor. Now, right click on prohibit access to control panel and PC settings. Then, click on edit. Now, if you disable it, uh, if you disable this setting, your control panel, you are accessible to your control panel or you can uh, select not configured both are same okay uh, i am selecting the not configured as because by default not configured is selected okay not configured then apply okay now i am going to open control panel
Look, now I can access to control panel, and now I am trying to open PC settings. Right, click on Start. Click on Settings. Look, now I can also access to settings. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. This is all for today. Keep watching for next tutorial.